Welcome back, everybody. You Albany and Siena made it official today. The Albany Cup will continue. However, only two of the three doubleheaders in the new contract will be played at the Times Union Center. For the first time since renewing their basketball rivalry as Division I opponents, the Saints will play the Great Danes on the U Albany campus. That's scheduled for the 2016-2017 season. The new contract begins this December 12th with a men's-women's doubleheader at the TU Center. Since 2001, the series has drawn an average of nearly 11,000 fans per game. The Siena men lead the Division I series 9-5, but UAlbany has won the last three, and with that, UA has the ability to dictate more terms in this ever-emerging crosstown rivalry. I was just agreeing with Will that there's not a game you can find to replace this, and so it certainly wasn't going to end on my watch. I fought hard to make sure the series did not end. It's going to be sold out. It's going to be a tremendous environment. It's going to be a tough ticket to get your hands on, um, and anybody that's complaining about it right now, they'll warm, up, they'll warm up to it. I'll help them. I think the community really wants to get out and support everybody, not just one or the other team. For young children, for girls, for families to be able to come out um, and just see two great basketball games, that's what we're trying to do um, for our and in a new twist, the third year will include both men's teams competing as part of a to-be-determined national multi-team tournament. Both UAlbany and Siena will play two additional games at a high major opponent and one additional game against another mid-major school. And that's only for the 2017-2018 season.